Hello, it's Jason Payne for Cold Banker, Dan Hop Realtors. Once again, I'm at the community of Veramindi in New Braunfels, Texas. I love the location of this community because you're right in the heart of everything in New Braunfels. Anyways, the house behind me is being built by Perry Homes for one of my clients, and they just got cabinets into it. So that means we're about a month out from closing, but I want to do a follow-up tour to show what this house looks like as of mid-August 2024. Let's go check it out. Now we are in the Vista Alta section and I do love this section a lot. I've done a couple of like motorcycle tours riding around it because all these homes are going to have green space lots behind it. And that's very hard to find in this uh, very many community. So I'm happy that my clients got one of these lots. And if you're seeing the color of this brick and go, oh, that's salmon color is like hideous. Don't worry, Perry will be painting these brick. It's probably gonna be a gorgeous white brick and this house will be beautiful. It does have a three car garage on it. We do have some cleaners in here today just because building a house is messy and one of the things that Perry likes to do is keep a clean work site. So they're in there right now. They know I'm coming, so I'm not gonna scare them. All right, let's head on inside. If you haven't done so already, hit that like button. That does help my algorithm a lot. And yeah, it's really hot out today, so uh, please hit that like button because I'm putting in work for you guys. All right, we're right when we come in, you got a nice wide hallway. We've got these cool tray ceilings up here. No electricity yet, so uh, bear with me on some of the lighting. But you got to have your two guest bedrooms, well, two secondary bedrooms up front. There's one of the ladies cleaning. So nice tall ceilings in here. And there's the other gentleman cleaning in the good size closet right there. Eight foot doors in this house. And if you saw, we've got tall ceilings. Uh, it's always good to have eight foot doors. It really does change the feel of the house. This is gonna be the shared bathroom up front. It can be your full bath. And this bedroom's gonna look just the same as the one next to it. I'll give you a little better view of the closet. Let's see if we can see it, it might be a little dark. But little mini walk-in closets there, nicely sized. All right, coming on back out. Here's your access to your garage and get a better feel of, this is a full three car garage. Very rare to, well, very handy to have, especially if you've got more than one vehicle. All right, I love how this space here kind of opens up even taller ceilings right in this spot. And you've got another bedroom kind of tucked away around this side. So an okay size bedroom. I would not say this is a large bedroom by no means, but we do have a broken window. So if you haven't watched my channel, there's always gonna be a broken window when you're getting a house built. And I just consider that good luck now. So this house is of course, as you can tell, under construction. And I believe my memory serves correct. This is the laundry room and it is. Okay, it's gonna be tough to see in here, but yep, there's the laundry room. Coming around, this is the flex space. Uh, Perry did allow my client to do a little customization. They added this wall here, kind of filled it in because with this plan, there would be just kind of a pillar there but they moved this wall out a little bit, making this room a little bit bigger. My client's gonna be using this as their music room. But if you're getting this house built, you can use this for whatever you want, an office, uh, media room, whatever you want to do. All right, now we're coming into the main living space and there's plenty of room in here, lots and lots of lighting. And like I said earlier in the video, Cabinets just went in and typically once cabinets have come in, you're about a month out from closing. So I'm excited about that. They went with some dark brown cabinetry. This is gonna be your pantry set up here. So good size pantry. And that's really gonna be nice. There's just the two of them. So they don't need too big of a space. Uh, this is gonna be your breakfast nook area and slash formal dining room. But I do like how they have lights all the way around it. But this is a big selling point. Um, my guys were looking to build on one acre, a one acre lot out in Vintage Oaks. They started price shopping and realizing it's gonna be more expensive than they thought to build on a one acre lot. So this is a really nice alternative because you're gonna have a nice patio space, but this space behind here 
is going to be kind of see where the fence is that's going to be the cutoff where their yards at but everything back here is going to remain natural upkept by the community but you're gonna have beautiful oak trees all around you and really quiet i mean you just don't get this level of quietness i'm excited to see what's coming in the community of Mindy. uh right now they're building some like assisted living apartments but down the road they are going to be building more uh restaurants bars some really nice parks and stuff so this community is early on in this process they're going to be building for the next 15 years in this community but so many more things are coming all right coming into the master bedroom once again going through the eight foot doors we got a tub in the master bedroom because that's where it belongs but then coming into the master bath so you see we just got the cabinets in here as well do like the extra light coming in from this window. You got a water closet, linen closet. Well, this is another thing my client wanted specially done. So, and Perry Homes accommodated it. They got a little mud, a step down shower, and he didn't want to have a bunch of glass that he had to clean water spots off all the time. So they built a little half wall for him. They will put some glass right there, but that's kind of out of the splash zone. And they took the tile all the way up. All right, into the master bedroom closet. Let's see how my GoPro does on the low light. All right, decent sized closet, especially for two people. All right, I'm excited about this house. Um, done a couple of videos of it throughout the build process already. And the next video I do, this house can look completely different once again. All right, I hope you enjoyed the follow-up tour for a house being built by Perry Homes in the very many community. If you did like it, hit that like button, of course, want to subscribe to my channel, but most importantly, share these videos with your friends and family, especially if you're moving to the area and don't already have a real estate agent. And if, when you're shopping for an agent, if they do stuff like this, hey, I'm available. So my contact information will be in the description box. Just reach out to me and I'll be happy to help. All right, take care now. Bye.